Hi guys, Graham here and today I'm going to show you how to back up your worlds and characters for the Steam version of Terraria. Fat Pikachu! Okay guys, so this is a really simple process, so let me just take you through it step by step. So the first thing you need to do is open up Windows Explorer, like I have there, and then go into your either, it may be called My Documents, or just documents. Mine's is called documents because I am using Windows 10. Yours may look slightly different if you're using a previous version of Windows, but it should always be in the My Documents folder. So open up documents, and then within there, you'll see My Games, go into that. And from within there, you'll see Terraria if you open up that folder. And there you have it, guys. You have players and you have worlds. Those are the two folders that contain your characters that you've created and the different worlds that you've created as well. Now what I'd recommend doing is copying both of those by highlighting them, right click and go to copy and then paste them into a completely different location somewhere on your machine. So if you really wanted to, you could create a new folder on your desktop, for example, called backup. And I'll just do it now and then go into that folder and you could paste those files in there. And what that will do is it will then create a copy of those characters and worlds in a safer location. So just in case those original folders become corrupted. Now a really good practice is to actually copy them to a completely separate hard drive. I have a separate hard drive and I've named it my D drive here. And I've created a backup folder of in there that I have those files in. Now, if you want to take it a step further, what you can do is put in a pen drive or an external hard drive, and you can even copy them onto that external hard drive and keep it in a completely separate location from your PC. For instance, in case your PC, ha uh, PC? <laughs> in case your PC has a malfunction where maybe the motherboard will short out and kill the hard drive then you've lost the data. But if you keep the data on a, maybe a pen drive or an external hard drive as well, then you know that that data is backed up separately from your machine. And you can even take that round to a friend's house and you can give them a copy of your world and a copy of your characters if you really wanted to, just for an example. But guys, that is really all there is to it. It's not a difficult process. I would recommend you probably do it uh, regularly, even once a week, depending on how much you play Terraria, even after every time you play it. It's entirely up to yourself if you want to do it that way, but uh, that's what I do personally. But anyway, guys, I hope you have found this helpful. If you have, hit that like button. If you're new to the channel, hit subscribe. That would really help me out a lot, guys. And I hope you have got some good value out of this video, and I will catch you next time. Bye-bye.